All right, we got clean track. Oh, right on that wall. Cause I've been sipping on Henny I got the study of my vision And she ain't from the city And she ain't foreign And she boring Love the way you twerk and shot What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel I'm Evil Rabbit Here on Forza Motorsports 6 Back again for some more drifting This time we're gonna try something a little bit different We're gonna take this base Z28 Off the showroom floor It's a beautiful car I've been meaning to try and drive this thing in Forza 6 for a while Take this base 2015 Z28 Take it to Prague or another track, see how she slides stock, then maybe do some mild tuning on it and see if I can't get a good basic tune for myself that I'm comfortable with, but I want to drive it stock first, see how it slides stock, and make minor, you know, slow adjustments, progressive adjustments up to see, you know, if we can't keep it and see what adjustments make worse and better and see if I can't get a good dialed tune in for this car. So we're going to head to the track, see how this thing drives stock. And I was having a lot of fun at Prague, so I think it's a good place to test it because it's got some low speeds and some high speeds and some uphills and some downhills. So it's a good place to test and make, you know, I think an all-around good tune. Adjust my headset a little bit. So we're going to rip this thing stock first. Stock Z28 2015 off the showroom floor. Let's uh see what she can do. Oh, it sounds sick. All right, here we go. Stock Z28. Nothing fancy. Let's see what we can do. Oh boy. Um, and it slides. Actually, really good stock. Uh, okay. We may not have to make much modification to this car. All right, let's see what we can do going up this hill. Oh, a little grip up there. We may have to change the entire stuff around. Maybe gear ratios. I feel like that just bogged down a lot. There we go. Oh, wow. Oh, just tap. Oh, just a tap. We lost our tail light and our wing, but you know what? This car. Um. I don't really want to touch it, but we're going to make some modifications to it. Maybe change the suspension a little bit. Look at that. I just. Oh my god. You've got to be kidding me. <laughs> this car is money right now. Just out of the box. Don't lose those points. Reverse entry. Clutch kick. Killed that a little bit. Probably should have downshifted. Wow. Um, I think I might have found my new favorite car. Oh, we're going to go too wide. It's okay. No, no, ah, oh, oh, we didn't hit anything. We're good. We just cracked the tail light and lost a wing. So stock out of the box is E28. Um, yup. I don't really want to make much modifications to this thing at all. We may change it a little bit. Probably put a cage in it, some brakes. So we can do somewhat of a tandem brakes. Oof. Oh boy. But I'll definitely be able to tell if anything I do to it messes it up. Because this thing slides very well right now. I mean, if you follow the channel, you've watched most of my other Forza 6 videos. You've noticed I've been slowly getting better. Now, I don't know if maybe I'm just getting better or this just car is pretty, pretty dialed. So this E28, not gonna lie. Rip it in there. We'll probably threw that way too hard. Nope. We got it. Oh my god. Okay, so 
We're going to go make some slight modifications to this car. We're going to try to do this uphill section again. Maybe... I don't think I'm going to change the power. I kind of like the power, but I think we're going to have to change gear ratio a little bit. There we go. Oh, I went in the wrong gear, but we're still good. Wow. Yep, this car is pretty pretty butter right now. I mean, look at that. Like, I'm not really fighting this car at all. Reverse entry. Little clutch kick. There we go. Oh my god. I mean, you look at this and you think I'd be driving this car all day. Literally, this is my first time on the track with this car. Oh boy. This... I, I don't know. I don't know. I'm at a loss for words right now. I like it. I'm having so much fun in this car right now. Ooh. This thing. <laughs> Alright, if you haven't driven this car stock, hop into this car, drive it stock, and just, you know, get it sideways. Because this thing. Ooh, don't want to mess that. Just tap on those, right? We're good. Wow. All right. So, we got this little section here that I can't seem to get right. Everybody else does, so we're going to try this again. So, a little bit. There we go. Oh, no. Uh, wasn't soon enough. It was not soon enough on that, but managed to save the car somewhat. All right, yup, I found my new car. New favorite car. It's a good basic starting point here. Now we're just gonna make the modifications as we feel fit. Of course, we're gonna have to slap a cage in this thing and make it tandem safe. All right, so let's go uh, modify this sucker a little bit and see what we can not mess up. Because that car was definitely getting it. All right, so. Uh, we don't want to add any arrow. Nope. Uh, we're gonna leave the engine, drivetrain, we're gonna leave everything, we're gonna leave all of that. Let's see what power are we at. Nope, I don't wanna do that one. Nope, no quick upgrade. What are we at power-wise for this car? 505. I feel like we'll throw an intake on. And exhaust, bump us up to 538. I think that's why I liked it, is it a very good, you know, basic tune set. So... We're definitely going to slap a cage in this thing, see what the weight change is. Okay. See if we can't weight reduction this back to... Oof. Wow, it drops a lot. Okay, so we'll drop it down a little bit. Not all the way. I did like the weight of the car. So, part of me does not want to change the suspension to race. See what we can do modifying tweaking wise, but we are gonna need brakes, that's for sure. It already got it has brakes, but we're gonna throw a clutch in there. Race transmission. I feel like it, I feel like the factory diff is good. So we're gonna leave that. We're just gonna do the range transmission, all that. Let's go see what we can change on suspension, see what the camera and caster and everything is like sut at Let's see here. Tuning. Tire pressure we're going to leave. Gearing we will m do a little more acceleration. So we can't adjust this. Alright, so we are going to go get suspension. Because I want to be able to make some adjustments. Go with suspension. We'll see how bad this makes it. So let's go put a quick bass tune on this thing and go back and see what it feels like from the factory compared to what it is now. Let's just give a little more camber. We'll leave that a little more caster. Lower it all the way. We'll leave all that. Brakes. I want to lower the brakes for almost like a tandem set. 
We're gonna leave the stock there. So we're gonna go drive this now and see uh, if the changes we made uh, screw it up. So I'll see you guys back at Prague. All right, so we're back here at Prague in the Z28. It's slammed. It sounds amazing. All right, let's see if the modifications that we just did affect this handling that much. I may have to get rid of those hideous wheels, but we'll see. There we go. Ooh, I like the way that wheel came back, though. Okay, so gear ratio. We need to do more acceleration in the gear ratio. I see that already. So let's make that change. I don't think we can. Ah, there we go. Let's make that change to the gearing. All right. And then we're going to restart it because that's an immediate change that we needed to make because it bogged in third. All right, let's do it again. thing just sounds so mean. Alright, here we go. I don't think the suspension settings messed it up too much. There we go. Oh, hold that out on the outside edge. Alright, so not bad. Not bad. Trying to get back into tuning here. So, so far so good. Let's see what we can do uphill here. Gearing is about the same as stock, maybe a little bit better. Oh. So, the changes that I made on this didn't seem to affect it. It handles a little bit better, actually, so. So far. Ooh, just tap. So far, changes are good. A little bit of understeer there. So I was able to pull the turnout with completely messing up and this thing still got it. So the gearing probably a little more acceleration we're gonna change a little bit. Yeah, definitely gonna change gearing a little bit more with like a little more acceleration on the gearing. Ooh, we're gonna leave the tires. A little more acceleration. If anything, I think I'm going to drop the rear tire a little bit, like so. All right, so we're going to restart this. Last time restart, we're just going to rip this how it is. And then we'll probably hop into an online session and this episode off, as always, with this car. Let's see how we do in a pack with this car, but I'm uh, pretty happy with how this thing is right now. All right, I think that's that's money for the gearing right there. Let's see if the tire changes made a difference. There we go. Okay, all right. So we didn't we didn't really mess it up, which is good. I was worried that we were gonna actually mess up, you know, the tuning on this car, and it was not gonna be able to drift anymore. Oh, that gearing is on point. Yup, definitely the right gear. Not the right gear. Clutch kick. Okay, so gear race is on point now. So we're good right now. Suspension seems good, just a tap. I heard that a little too late. Suspension and tires seem good. Try this through this section again and see. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Money. Money right now. This car rips. That's gonna be a really long e brake crab, but we got it. A little clutch out. Yep. Bank that. 9,000 points. Woo wow. Yep, I'm definitely happy with this car. We're definitely gonna have to hop into an online session. Uh, too fast. 
and see how we're gonna do against other cars though because that's the true test but the handling of this thing's all pretty good here so hopefully it's a pretty basic good tune that'll be good at all other tracks Ooh, did we get that one I think we got it that time we're good Curve hop didn't really affect it that much. Uh, uh save it. <sighs> okay. It'll come out and save that though. So it likes third gear. I'm definitely happy with this car. Definitely gonna go find an online session. So I will catch you guys once I find an online lobby. Yeah, 32,000 points in one lap. So I'll catch you guys when I get a lobby. All right, Rio, Mountain Circuit, Drift Hopper, Z28. Let's see how this thing does in a crowd. I think we got 12 other drivers here. Let's see uh, what we can do. Things, cars handled pretty well. I definitely, uh, definitely like this tune. It's a very mild tune, but it's my own tune and seem to be doing pretty well with it. So let's do it. There, uh, this is gonna be sketchy in the first part. I mean, I'll take that bump, thanks. Uh, problem with such a small track. All right, here we go. First big turn, stay in third gear. There we go. We may all hold, eh, don't hit that. Downshift. I got scared. Ooh. Oh, don't hit you. I don't want you to lose your points. Ooh. So glad I didn't hit that guy. Open it up. Oh, sad. So sad, but. Third. All tapping. Ooh. All right, that guy glitched and scared the crap out of me. That guy's glitching all over the place. All right, here we go. Oh, wrong way. Somehow saved that. I don't know how he's gonna lose that. Oh, oh no. Was doing good. Clutch kick second. All right, now that we got some open track, let's see what we can do. Brakes. Ooh, just a tap. Oh, we lost the wing. So I was doing good. Now we're not doing that great. But nice and hard though. There we go. Alright, now we got the feel of it. Now we got the feel of the car. I don't want to hit you! Oh my gosh! Better be. Oh, you just quit. I didn't even hit him. Uphill. There we go. Ooh. Just roasting the tires uphill. One gear. Likes to do that sometimes. I don't know why. All right, here we go. Early initiation. I got scared by that car. All right. Don't have to worry about being scared. He sh I shouldn't have been scared. He was ghosted, but. So, this E28 definitely handles very well. If you haven't tried it, stock. Give it a try, stock. Oh my gosh. Oh, really? Come on. Oh, that was perfect. 
mean, I'll take that tap initiation. Thank you. Let's kick it. There we go. Run that nice and wide. Okay. Every time. All right. We got this. I didn't want to hit him. I did not want to hit him. And then there's that guy. I mean, you hit me. It's only fair, right? He's going to mess up. I have a feeling he's going to mess up here. Oh, run that outside. I'll take that. Oh, come on, dude, go. Yep, I like the Z28 a lot. Oh my gosh, go. Stay in second gear, though, to this part. Off the red line. We go, that's better. Except for the clipping of the wall. Ooh. Oh. Don't wanna hit him! Excuse me! Oh you son of a Ah, oh, I was trying to go for the pass and he hits me. A clutch. Look at that. Except we're going to kill our points there because I got khaki. But it is a testament to the car. The car can do it as long as I don't screw up. So we can do this. We haven't been able to do this. Oh, is that guy ghost? There we go. Nope. Excuse me. Don't lose those. Little clutch kick. Get a little more points. There we go. All right. We got clean track. On that wall. Oh, I thought we were going to be able to link it. Oh, that was like the best initiation I have done in that section. That was that was pretty awesome, actually. Not going to lie. Oh, my. Hit points. There we go. Subaru again. All right, here we go. The gear. Is it early? And I always go too early. Nope. Ah. So I think that's pretty much gonna do it here for this episode here on Forza Motorsport 6. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I'm having a lot of fun in the Z28. Um. My drifting skills are definitely getting there now after, you know, being on recently a couple of days. So comment down in the comment section down below if you think so, too. There we go. Ooh, yes. As always, you guys know you can follow me on Facebook, Twitch, Twitter, and Instagram. All of which are found in the description box below. I'd like to thank you guys for watching. I'm Evil Rabbit. And I'm out. I'm loving, I'm tipsy cause I've been sipping on Henny. I got the study of my vision and she ain't from the city.